out on the big water today. I want to get this set up real quick. <laughs> I don't know how the dog's feeling right now. <laughs> today we're on the ice targeting one of the best eating fish in fresh water. But the weather forecast isn't looking good, calling for a potential snowstorm and heavy winds. But the plan was to drop off my wife at work and target one of my favorite species to catch and definitely my favorite to eat, the yellow perch. I only had a few hours to fish before I had to pick up my wife, so I didn't expect much, but I had no idea what I was in for. If you guys are new here, my name is Marcus. My channel is based around the outdoors, camping, fishing, and spending time on the lake. I have lots of adventures in the works, so hit that subscribe button to stay tuned and drop a like for the algorithm. Awesome on the dinner bell. I should get this heavy camera going because there's another big one flying around here. All right. All right, so we're having the big light today. Ice has been sketchy all year, but I've only been here for a little bit. I already got myself a nice jumbo here. Um, I'm gonna give this guy a measure, but definitely an ice keeper. Also, I might bring the, the dog a little closer to me here. Absolute beautiful perch. Oh, I'm so excited, guys. These are some of the best tasting fish around. Really, really nice fish. Wow, look at that. Oh, that one came on the minnow. So I saw it coming around. There's a bunch of small ones down there right now. And this guy was just like chasing my minnow. My minnow was super active and it just chased it around. I watched it. So cool. Beautiful perch. I'm gonna measure this guy after. Time to get back to fishing while school's here. You know, I'm thinking this one should go back. Awesome. Keeper. 
Not a jumble like the last ones, but still a good fish. All these salted minnows here. So when they die in my bucket, I'll take them out, dry them off, and then uh, toss them in some salt overnight. And then the next day I'll give them a rinse. And that takes all the moisture so they don't like fall apart. I don't know if you guys have ever fished with dead minnows before, but it's really difficult uh, trying to keep them all together. So salting them, definitely the way, the way to go. Um, I'm gonna give this a little more time, but I think I wanna tie a bigger leader on there as well. I think that might help us out a little bit. Another keeper. Yeah, that first one I caught is gonna look uh, small beside these guys. Okay. Again, nothing huge, but good one in the frying pan later. Dinner bell again. Oh my god. There's more down there, guys. There's more big ones. Another one. Oh my god. Another one. Three in a row there. Wow. They're eating. Look at that. Really nice fish. One over there. This is, this is crazy guys, like I have not had perch fishing like this in a really long time. missed some really big ones um, but I've caught some really nice ones there's two of uh, the nicer ones that I've caught okay perfect eaters again I've seen some like monsters cruise by a couple of them I missed I set the hook on and ripped them in out right out of their mouth but hopefully I can catch one big jumbo today and then uh, if I get anything over like 12 13 inches I'm probably just gonna let it go but I'm gonna be trying to keep probably around 25 perch. Usually I come out four, five, six times in a winter. But this winter has been terrible. It's been super warm. The ice has been sketchy. Um, I'm feeling really confident of what I'm on right now, but I haven't caught and kept really perch this year. So I want to get a good haul. Okay, so again, two really nice fish. I'll give them a matter here. All right, so this is my biggest so far. 12 inches and this other one's probably just a little shy and then a few other really nice fish and the dog 
is absolutely chilling. How you doing, buddy? So these guys were the first two that I caught and definitely the smallest. Wow, awesome little pile. I don't know if you guys can see just how clear the water is. I'm spending most of the day here hunched over just trying to sight fish. Not really using my, my fish finder that much. So I'm gonna drop my lines out while I eat some food. Hopefully I can get that really big one and maybe a few more keepers. Again, we're going for 25 and I think we're at 13, 12 or 13 right now. Okay, so make sure you guys stay tuned. Okay, as for my setups here, so the one that's been doing really well is the Frostbite Dinner Bell. Okay, so it's the, the Frostbite Dinner Bell. It's this pink color with a little minnow head. And then my other one, I'm just going super simple. And it's a split shot, it's an octopus hook, and a minnow. I'll show you guys that right here. Okay, so a couple split shots down to a minnow and an octopus hook. So I need to pick up my wife eventually. She's finished work at hopefully around four. It's around one right now. So I'm gonna, I should probably text her and figure out what time I should uh, be heading out of here. Again, hopefully I can catch a couple more. We'll have a good, uh, we'll have a good fish fry. Two little dinks like this. Uh, look at this. There's a huge one down there, and I end up one like with two that aren't even five inches in total. I was keeping guys like this, but there won't be any more. Another really nice one, guys. What a great day. It's really nice to be out in the big water. Uh, I don't know if I said it before, but this season has been really warm and the ice has been really sketchy. So getting out here for the day uh, has been amazing. Normally I come up a bunch of times throughout the year, but this year I've only been out one. This is really my first time coming out. I did stop by here one time. We checked the ice. We fished for maybe an hour. Um, it was really busy. It was a weekend. But during the week, there's barely anyone here and the fish are on fire. Um, I'm doing really well. This is my best perch day I've had in a really, really long time. I got one on right now. Um, like normally I come up here and you, it's pretty much guaranteed you're gonna catch a little perch like this, which is fine. But honestly, I've been avoiding these guys most of today and I've been able to get some really nice ones. small 
So I don't have too much longer. I have to pick up my wife from work. She finishes at four and it's gonna take me a little bit to pack up, get everything out of here. But uh, hopefully, yeah, hopefully we can uh, get a couple more to the, to the pile. It's also crazy here. I'm in about 13 feet of water. You can see perfectly fine. I could probably see a lot deeper as well if I tried. But this is the first spot of the day and it's definitely going to be uh, the only spot that I'm going to be trying. Okay, I'm tossing minnow head on. So again, I'm using a frostbite spoon. I think it's called the dinner bell. A little pink and silver. It's been doing really well for me. I should probably text my wife and see uh, how she's doing at work. Well, I have to say that was a really good day. Cass is about to finish work here. I'm about an hour away from her, so I gotta pack up and uh, get these fish away. I just wanna show you guys. Let's see if they're still here. I don't know if you can see this well, but. I've watched a bunch of fish around. Well. Awesome day. I didn't even get a chance to eat or anything. It's pretty windy, but should be a fine walk back. Let's do uh, a couple measures here. It's one of the biggest ones. So, uh, this is definitely one of the biggest. This is the biggest, I think. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen fish. No hiders anywhere. Wow, oh, that's awesome. Oh, I was hoping for a couple more, but that'll do. Oh, I think Jora's had enough. Oh, that's a good one. Let me know what keeper here. All right, 19. Oh my god. Big ones are here. Another one. Wow. Okay, I said at 19 when I was doing the, sorry, 18 when I was doing the outro, now we're at 22. Another really nice one. Not too big, but really good eater. Okay, I need to back up and go pick up my wife. Unreal. Oh. Those are my biggest ones. 
Jar's done. 